Season 343 here once again with another unboxing. That sounds more like it. Energetic. I've been really tired today for some reason, but um, I haven't a clue. But I've got this really awesome unboxing. Gonna have something to do with my totem poles. Or not uh, totem poles. Uh, trust system. So, I also was down there chewing on the, uh, what do you call it? Um, if you haven't checked it out, uh, I have TikTok now. So, if you guys would like to go check out my TikTok, I will try to link that in the description below. We will see what we got there. Uh, if it's not linked in the description, that means I wasn't able to figure my link out. But uh, I can put my name in parentheses. You guys can go check me out. It's easy. Day to three. Whew, excuse me. Nathan343. So, uh, yeah. Alright. I started doing some cool stuff on there. I got some stuff here. And that can be put in the trash. Here, kitty kitties, you want a big box? And we'll have another big box. I can't figure out which is the way I'm assuming that's what it's supposed to be. Alright, so we got another big box and it doesn't happen to say what's in here. It says bolts, which you can't see because stickers over it. All that stuff. Uh, these are, of course, <laughs> made in China. I am so sorry. I have, uh, been yawning. I'm trying to cut out the yawns and trying to make this video a little better, but like I said, I think it's the new medicine I'm on. I started taking some new medicine to make me healthier, to have, and it's my body getting used to it. It's draining me a lot. So, um, if we get a little book. Well, I'll tell you this. It's a moving head. But it's not that moving head because we've already reviewed those. If you would like to go see the review of this moving head, go check it out right here. All right, let me see. Yeah, you guys can see that. No, I think this may have been the bottom. Hello, look at that. Yeah, there we go. Whoops, hit the light. There we go, another box. Yeah, that was definitely the. Uh, Whoa, we're getting a camera. We've got some more moving heads. And it's paper falling on the ground. So I'm going to adjust this camera just a scoosh. So we've got some brackets. We don't need those. Of course, we've got these cables. And I'm going to be looking at getting bigger cables for these. These are... Uh, no idea what's in here. We've got another power cable. we got another moving head. we got a set of two of these check out. Kind of heavy. Man. There we go. That's the screws. And... Oh, that's sticky. Very sticky. That's the screws and stuff that go to the, the brackets. Which we'll be putting them on here in a little bit. I'll go ahead and pull the paper off these. Set these aside. This is actually some pretty cool styrofoam. If you got like a a uh, be able to store these in, which we're gonna try a box just so you guys can see what you guys could store these in. I'm gonna show you what uh, I've got a couple other moving heads stored in, and then I'm gonna try a couple other ones just to kind of see if they would fit. So this is a moving head. Has a fan on the back. This is a gobo. Uh, it's got an adjustment here. You can adjust the focus. It's little. But it's uh, it's pretty it's it's a mini one, so you can say mini LED spot, 60 watt. Um, it's got some weight to it. It definitely feels feels good. We're gonna see this thing move because I'm gonna put both of them up there, and we're gonna I'm also gonna try to get them a little further. I'll get a night shot for you of how they look at night. Uh, the design looks like it's really built. The gears, it's got a fan there. And a fan here on the back, so I assume this will have some fan noise, but with music and stuff, you probably won't hear it. DMX in, DMX out. Of course, you've got your, uh, it says what power cord that is. Uh, only use with something. 
thing you normally use with this cable. So we're going to go ahead and get the brackets hooked on and uh, get these things mounted to the truss. Um, I don't know how this focus thing works. We'll figure it out. Uh, I'll probably have to put it, I'll probably put it on sound active mode. We'll get some sound going here. Of course, that's what we've got. It shows uh, Master Slave. We've got uh, 11 and 9 channels. So if you do this DMX, you can set this up for 11 or a 9 channel. Uh, see, it has an address of 1 to 512. Oh, uh, sure. So, um, it's got three different show modes. Zero, which is recommended. You have sound active on, voice control off, voice control off. Uh, you have voice sensitivity on here. So you can control how much it picks up. Uh, you got your balance. Your LED. Uh, screen after five seconds. Oh, off screen. So you can set that to where you're, you know, you just have like a little red dot so it won't show in the shows. Uh, display, reverse, show positive, uh, your pan, uh, your tilt, and then your reset. Uh, so I don't know if you guys are seeing that or not. And of course, you got all your channel one features, uh, your nine mode, and your 11 mode. Um, we've all reviewed this, this light here. So uh, these are the spider lights, also from the company, uh, same company, I do believe. Um, if you guys want to go check those uh, reviews out of those lights, you can go check that out there on the top of your screen. Should be getting a little deal up there. And you can go check those out. Um, so, yeah. All right, I'm going to get to it. I will. Uh, Probably do a time lapse of hooking these up and putting these up on truss. Chave uh, that's going to be uh, sometime next week. I've got some other cool stuff coming, some more uh, um, awesome, cool products. So you're definitely going to want to stay tuned uh, to the channel. Uh, but I haven't fired them up yet, so this is the first time firing it up. I'm sure they're going to do it. Oh, wait a minute, I forgot. We need to put a after they get fired up. I'm going to connect the DMX cable real quick and uh, give it a slave and master and we will go from there. Fire them up. We're firing up. We're going to do a little warming. Then we're going to warm up, spin around. Probably go back to home. Looks like they're pretty much on, on. I'm gonna go ahead and go menu. That's your channel. Well, as you can see, the cats like it. And I will say, um, let me get this on the tripod here. I will say, these lights I am very impressed with. Um, the DMX ones, um, they're in sync perfectly. They got some cool designs. 
shoot on the ground right now even though you can't see them. Um, I'll just kind of show you how in sync. I mean, they're talking to each other really, really well. I've got the sensitivity at about a half. Uh, I've turned it all the way down too to kind of see and it still picked up. You had to have the music a little bit louder but it still picked up. Still picked up majority of the sound and still, like if you turn the sound completely down. Eventually it goes into a slower, there it goes. Into a slower mode where it doesn't spin around as much. But then as soon as I talk or something, it picks it up. Because I've got the sensitivity, it's also picking up a little bit on the fans. I probably need to turn sensitivity down just a skosh. But when you turn the music up, they get to going a lot faster. But, yeah. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and maybe raise this up a little bit more. Let you see what it's doing on the ground. So, here, I'll just kind of walk around and hold the camera just a little bit so you guys can see. Cats love it. I like those. They're cool. I've got these up on this, just a T-truss. So if you put these up on a T-truss, bring your wiring to the center, run it down, make it all nice and clean. This will look really good. I don't have it cleaned up because uh, just for the video, but yeah, you clean this up. I don't even have my tripod legs all the way out and it's doing just fine. But I'm gonna go ahead and un-DMX these and shut them off, turn them back on and see what they do. Well, I have done something a little special. I added two of these lights just to kind of show you how they go with other moving heads. They go perfectly. These are the Gobo lights. for watching guys if uh, if you liked the video give it a thumbs up if you didn't give it a thumbs down leave your comments below uh, i read most of them uh, i've got it now figured out where my comments are actually coming to my phone um, sometimes they don't come as soon as you comment but generally i, I get them the same day uh, but go ahead and get uh, commented uh, if you haven't done so already and you're new to the channel uh, i'm the nathan 343 
and I do videos of all different kinds of products. I do videos of uh, building things. I do lawn care videos. I do all kinds of cool stuff. So you want to get subscribed, and then you also want to get that notification bell turned on. Uh, so that when I upload, you know to go watch one of my videos. But with all that being said, I hope you guys have a great, wonderful rest of your day. And we will see you in the next one.